So, <clears throat> I uh, wanted to start out this video with a typical Saturday with us and the twins, and I just wanted to show you the before the twins come down for breakfast and come play. So, I just wanted to show you a little bit. Um, we have this kind of blocking uh, the TV area. And then you have the couch, and then this one blocks out into the open one there, which looks like a hot mess. And then uh, we have the hallway for them to play in, and then we have this baby gate closed, because, yeah, we have it open with a bungee cord right now. So in the evenings, Greg and I can just open, close, whatever. And then you have the kitty condo for the cats to relax. So this is my before the babies are up. Those should be full of the balls, like base basketballs and footballs and stuff, but they're all down in the hallway because they like to throw things. And, yeah. All okay, right. so now the babies are awake, and this is them during breakfast time with Daddy. Say hi. Hello. I'm doing like a day in the life of the twins blog, vlog, tog. So I showed up before they showed up. Hi. How are you? They're having blueberry waffles this morning with a little breakfast bar. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. Is that his friend? That's his, yes. yes. She brought down her brother's uh, lion friend. He doesn't really pay much attention to it unless she has it. But she left her hippo and duck upstairs. So, alright. That's it for breakfast time. Say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Oh. Okay, so it's a few hours after breakfast and the kids are now... Playing. Hi. Hey, hey. Hi. They they love the camera. Right? So basically what they do is they play with all the toys that we have for them and play with mommy's camera. And they uh watch Sesame Street and other stuff like that. I have the camera pointing at him, so he's very intrigued. Oh. So now he's on my lap. <laughs> Everyone's trying to get to mommy. Sorry, it's very shaky and crazy, but... This is how it usually is on a Saturday morning. The kids are happy to play. He's touching the touch screen. <laughs> and I have my daughter here climbing on me. Hey. Oh. Yes. All right. Alright, so that is basically a typical Saturday morning after breakfast and right before their lunch. So, say bye bye, Lucy. Say bye bye, Bashy. Yeah. 
Oh. <laughs> and now they're both looking at the camera towards daddy. Who's on TV? Elmo? Momo. Elmo. Momo. Momo, Greggy. Momo. Just wanted to give you a bit of a background of our car. This is a 2012 Dodge Grand Caravan, and each kid has a uh, captain's chair, and each kid has the mirror with the music, and these light up right here. And then this is like a little friend that comes with it, but they don't really care. And uh, yeah, they both have 
identical seats and then our back row is down because we have our stroller we have a couple balls and toys and stuff for them to play their diaper bags are basically two small backpacks oh look at that Hi. so this is the back kind of showing uh, that little red bag is our uh, yeah. emergency Car kit. Safety yeah, stuff. we got some ex extra bungee cords because what we tend to do is with when we lift these uh, back seats up, we tend to bungee the um, stroller the stroller onto that last row. But that way yeah, it doesn't bounce and move everywhere. But everyone has extra sweatshirts and jackets, including ourselves, just for uh, travel purposes. But yeah, this is our minivan. And usually when we go out anywhere, we like to let the kids run outside before we uh, pack them in the car and go. Because it just kind of gets their energy going and their blood flowing and stuff like that. It makes them happy to be outdoors. Yeah. I was going to show the magnets, but I'll show it on my other car here. This is the car I take to work. We have identical magnets. Um, on each car except mine is kind of faded one of them says thyroid cancer awareness <laughs> and then the other one says proud parent of twins and Greg is closing the girl the the door yeah see basically has the same magnets thyroid cancer awareness and then you have the proud parent of twins I like that it says parent and not mom or dad because whoever's driving it is a proud parent. <laughs> Except if it was like a grandparent, but we don't have to worry Either about way, that. Either way, they'd still be a proud grand. So, yeah. That's the minivan. We love it. I love it. Yes. It's, it's perfect for our family. There's enough room for all of us and then some. So, I'm glad we upgraded from our Honda CRV. I miss it though, but still, it's good. Okay. Moving on to the next episode. No. All right. So now that we've been out and about doing our thing, we are at a local park. There's actually grass in the middle of New Mexico. How about that? And this is where we uh, bring the kids to play. Throwing balls around, running, kind of get them tired before taking them home, and hopefully get them better sleep. So, looks like they're having a birthday party over there. So, just gonna sit in the grass. Come back here, I want that. Velcro your shoe. Me, Velcro your shoe. Hi. Looks like Little Man decided to go running today. We went running. Hi, hey, Sheila. Do you want to film with mommy? Do you want to film with mommy? Yeah? Hi. <laughs> Where's daddy? I see daddy. I see you now. Whoa. You see your daddy? Watch, watch this. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Dad. <laughs> what are you doing, baby girl? She's my uh, first assistant. Right now? She the director of cinematography? Yes. Oh. Wow. Wow. Hold up. Let's get you in the clip, eh? Ooh, look at you. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> hi. Say hi. My name is Lucy. Yeah. My name is Bashi. Yeah. Who's that? 
Hey. <laughs> My name is Greggy. Uh, <laughs> You're silly. I try. Yeah, look at that. Look at Daddy. It's Daddy. Yeah. Whoop. Whoop. Uh oh. Uh oh. Go run, little children. I want to. I want to film you running. You may have to put that away for them to to run. Completely. I agree. I agree. I hate when he does that. <laughs> Lay in the grass. All right. So we're. I'm gonna drop this. Not literally, but. Time to go play with the kiddos. They need to run. Okay, say bye-bye. Bye. 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 There goes my little man. Oh shit, I think she's realized what I'm doing. Lucy? Lucy? I've been caught. I believe you've been discovered. Shit. Hi. Here comes the other one. On that one. <laughs> Was that a handball? Just a little. Dad. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah. Welcome back. Hello. That was short lived. Hello. <laughs> it's Daddy. Lucy. <laughs> Go with daddy. Look at where the ball went. Bye. We really like this park because it's so open and green. And then, like, further down that way, you have a couple of playground thing bobbers like swings and slides and stuff. But being that there's a birthday party there, I don't want the kids to mess with them. So we like this big open area. Usually, during the weekday, you have, like, five different soccer practices here. That's how big this field is. And it's just nice to have a place to go with the kids when it's a good day. I mean, that's how I'm justifying it. It's either this or TV, and this is pretty entertaining to me right now. So, I try really hard to, you know, make sure that the kids aren't just watching TV all the time. Like, we try to educate them, we try to teach them ABCs and all three different languages and stuff like that, and have fun. Hi! <laughs> so what would you say about this park, Greg? Do you like it? It's okay. It's a playground and a nice big, large, open, grassy area. Yeah. So we only use this park on weekends because during the week there's always soccer practices. Yep. Usually girls. Yeah, we don't see a lot of boy soccer practices. Here or anywhere else. Actually. The only one I've seen is near the house. The, the yeah, that field. was like five year olds. That's what I'm saying, like I've never seen like bigger kids, but they are boys. Like that little man right there. His shorts are hanging low, well, so are hers. Hi. Yeah. Hey Lucy, do you like Elmo? 
Elmo. Hi. He's looking at the camera right now, looking at Daddy O. And now he's going to do the one thing I hate. I hate when he does that. <laughs> Oh, now she's going to do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Good job. <laughs> All right. So it's now Daddy recording. Does he? I did. You All right, so that was basically our entire day with the kiddos. Um, we gave them dinner at 7.30, I believe, and it's now 9 o'clock, so it's been about an hour now since they, we've been, we put them to bed and everything. And uh, Basically, bedtime is pretty simple. After dinner, we take them upstairs, and um, we change them into their pajamas, and... Sebastian has a projector projection mobile that has three buttons and lights up whatever and then Lucy has the the ladybug uh, twilight thing that has stars that pop out whatever and uh, we're right now in the transition of not giving them bottles at night in their crib so it's been about three days now since we've started that and it's been pretty decent and after we change them and get them into the cr into their cribs, I read them a story, and after the story, I kiss them good night and everything, and that's it. Actually, Greg says good night after he helps me change them and everything, and then I read the story, and then I leave, and then um, they'll cry for a little bit because yeah, like I said, we're getting used to not feeding them bottles in their crib, and then we don't hear from them again and yeah it's been an hour since we put them to bed and everything's cool so that's basically the day in the life of our twins and us go team so that's all i got talk to y'all later bye